guys! Today's video is going to be featuring products from May's Ipsy Bag. Prior to the video, I already applied some nail polish by Zoya in Jaclyn. Next, I'll be prepping my lips with Vaseline Lip Therapy. Now moving on to prepping the face. Here I'm using Instant Age Rewind Face Primer by Maybelline and evenly distributing it throughout my face. Here I'm grabbing Rimmel's Professional Eyebrow Pencil in dark brown and aligning my eyebrows. I'm just using the pencil to create the shape of my eyebrows and filling in the areas where I feel needs to be defined. Don't forget to blend out. Then I'll be using a brown matte brow powder to fill in my eyebrows. Okay, so the second item I'm using from the Ipsy bag is going to be concealer. This is in the color Vanilla and it's by Yabby. I'm going to take some product and apply that underneath my eyebrows to conceal any mistakes or any stray hairs that I may have. Don't forget to blend it out. I'm also going to apply some concealer on the top of my eyebrows just so that it stands out and outlines my eyebrows, making the shape more visible. Now let's prep the eyes. Here I'm using Wet n Wild Eye Primer from the Fergie Collection. I'm going to be grabbing my Super Stay Makeup Foundation from Maybelline and my e.l.f. powder brush and apply some of that product to my face. What I love about this product is that it gives me such good coverage. Don't forget to blend evenly. We do not want a streaky or cakey face. And then to set my foundation and to mattify the look, I'm just going to be using some translucent powder from MAC. Lightly dust that all over your face. For today's eye makeup, I'm using Urban Decay's Naked Basics Palette. I'm going to be grabbing the color WOS and applying that to my eyelids. Here I'm just using my fingers. Next, I'll be grabbing this brush right here and grabbing Foxy and applying that under my eyebrow area towards my crease area. Next, as a highlighter, I'm going to be using Venus and applying that in my brow bone area. With a soft blending brush, I'm going to be grabbing the color Naked 2 and sweeping this into my crease area using windshield wiper motions. Next, I'll be getting another blending brush and grabbing Faint, which is a darker brown, and applying that into my outer V area, or the outer corner. Next, with eyeliner, I'm going to be using Linear Intense by L'Oreal and applying a very thin line. I'll be adding a wing at the end, so all you have to do is just create that V and fill in. To finish off with the eyes, I'm going to be grabbing my favorite mascara and applying a generous amount of coats onto my lashes. Now going back to the face, I'm going to be grabbing this brown matte powder and applying that to the hollows of my cheeks to contour my face a little bit. I'm also going to apply that to the temples of my forehead and then be grabbing some of this pink peachy blush and applying that to the apples of my cheeks. For my lips, I'm going to be using Wet n Wild's Mocha Licious or 914C and just dabbing that color onto my lips.
From the Ipsy bag, my third item that I'll be using is a lip gloss from Juice Beauty in the color pink. And I'll just apply that to the center of my lips. This product is also from the Ipsy bag. It's a hair serum from Nume. And I'll just be grabbing a couple drops of those and applying that to the end tips of my hair. This will leave my hair looking shiny and smelling awesome. Also, the Pacifica Roll-On Perfume in Vanilla. I'm just going to apply that on and that pretty much completes my look for today. I hope you guys enjoyed my video and I'll see you next time. Bye!